The Holy Tales Tubby, Freckles, where are you? Yes, Gumball, we're here. Let's go, let's go. It's time to listen to a Bible story from Holy. Hello, kids. I was waiting for you to come. Today I'll be telling you a story about Hagar and Ishmael. Who are they? We'll get to know soon. Long, long time passed, and Abraham and Sarah did not have any children as God had promised them. Sarah was impatient, and so she sent her maid, Hagar, to Abraham and said, Have a baby with Hagar, and if she has a son, we can raise him as ours. Hagar and Abraham had a baby boy and named him Ishmael, but he was not a part of God's plan. Few days later, after this, Sarah had a son, just as God promised, and she named him Isaac which means laughter. Remember, Sarah had laughed when God said that she would have a baby. Once Isaac was born, Sarah became jealous of Hagar and her son. One day, Abraham threw a party for young Isaac, where Sarah heard Ishmael making fun of Isaac. She was very angry. Send Hagar and her son away. She told Abraham, I don't want Ishmael to share my Isaac's inheritance. This made Abraham very upset. Ishmael was his son too. God told Abraham that it's okay to send Hagar and Ishmael away. Isaac is the promised son. God said, But I promise to watch over Hagar and Ishmael and even build a nation from Ishmael's descendants because he is your son too. Next day, Abraham got up early in the morning and gathered food and water for Hagar to take as she and Ishmael left. He was sad to send them away. Hagar and Ishmael wandered for days and had nowhere to go. Soon, the water they had brought ran out. Hagar left Ishmael sitting in the shade of the bush and walked a short distance away from him and sat down and thought to herself, I can't stand and watch my son die. And tears rolled down her face. Meanwhile, Ishmael was crying and God heard him. God's angel came to Hagar and said, Don't be afraid, Hagar. God has heard your son's cries and promises to make him into a great nation. Go and comfort your little boy. The angel vanished. Suddenly, a well appeared in front of Hagar, full of water. She filled the jar and gave Ishmael a drink. Years passed and Ishmael grew up to become a strong young man and he married an Egyptian woman. So, did you all enjoy the story? Oh, yes, Holy. We did. We love all the stories you tell us. So, my question for today is, who was Abraham's promised son? Um, wasn't it Isaac? You are right, Tabby. Very good. Bye, kids. Until next time.